we are, we are very proud to be popular without being mainstream. Can you give an example of maybe what is Christoph bringing in most of the time? Uh, Christoph... Uh, well, he brings the coffee. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I, 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 my very speciality is to give grip green tea. <laughs> it's our <laughs> drug for, for compost. Seriously. It's true, I, I, it's true. It's you, true. Were, you were making the don't, green tea. Don't all let the time. me lie. Don't let me lie. <laughs> yeah, 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 it's true. Sorry, uh, sorry, uh, sorry about that. <laughs> I should I shouldn't <laughs> take the blanket to myself, really. <laughs> uh, uh, Christoph, um, well, we all three we are composers and producers. But uh, his uh, speciality uh, and his instrument is the computer. So he's uh, uh, who a lot of time who is going to the machine to uh, take our three uh, our uh, three ideas into the uh, to 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 begin to record the the he's making the beats also the uh, he spend hours to make the beats and uh, uh, yeah. and after uh, yeah. he makes beats <laughs> what, what do you like except for what what Eduardo brings in what is his Character when you can except green tea, mm -hmm. except <laughs> <laughs> just musically. Just. Musically, uh, no. Eduardo is Argentinian. He's coming. He's really coming from the tango scene. So, is in a way is a kind of the our tango um, reference. You know when we because Christophe and me we're coming more from the electronic side. So, we um, our our inspiration is coming from more from the outside of tango. Even if we love tango and we listen a lot of tango, but still, uh, he, still he listen much more than, than us. Do you see the difference that is really strong? The difference that he is really from Argentina and you are not from Argentina? Yeah, of course, course. Yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah. Pero por supuesto, querido. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> claro. You know the Argentinian people from Buenos Aires are very humble. No, uh, no, they, they ah, never. He's kidding. He's kidding. He's kidding. He's kidding. <laughs> But can you, yeah, you mentioned you, you were listening a little bit more to electronic music mm -hmm. uh, recently. Yeah. What was an artist or what style maybe in electronic music did trigger you to put that more back into your music? Um, I think it's mostly funny, it's not, it's not electronic music from Europe or UK anymore so much. It's much more really fresh stuff coming from South America, especially Argentina, for example, with uh, Cumbia Digital. But from, could be from Colombia, can be from Africa, from Angola with Kuduru, can be from Brazil by Le Funk. Uh, there's a lot, a lot of, I would call it decomplexed electronic music coming now from these countries. Now that, you know, production tools are much more easily available. Also, there, I think some of the, a lot of these countries, the, their own economic level rises, so they can buy computers, stuff, you know software they'll get it you know how and uh, they just start fiddling around with things and really some the most for me the most interesting stuff comes now from over there okay yeah you get a lot of influence from all these different styles is it do you think do you see your job maybe to introduce also the style and also tango to an audience that is maybe not looking that profoundly into these other genres that you maybe you present it more in a more accessible way to a new audience is that maybe can you say that? Yeah, maybe more accessible or more, I don't know, the form, we, we don't change the, 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 the ins inside. We don't change the, the essence of tango. We, it's, I think our music, is the essence is really made on tango and the folkloric music from Argentina. But all the form is true, it's transformed. And more, uh, we bring not only to another audience, but to a, new, a modernity, you know, something which is about uh, by bringing the beats and, and new sounds or elements, it's it's it's, a, it's our way to to make this music discovered by other people, you know. And it's exactly what happened from ten years. Many people discovered tango through the Tan project, which is great because after they can discover what was behind us, what was inspiring for us, you know. Um, but we are, we are very proud to be popular without being mainstream. You know, we are not doing commercial music. We are not played by commercial radios. And uh, uh, it's funny because it was an underground project, but we never been overground. So still underground or still very genuine, but, but underground in many countries, it's a lot of people.